hello guys welcome back to the channel so first of all what you have to do you have to just log in with the username one once you're done with this just simply come back over here and activate your cloud chain it will take a couple of seconds so just wait for that and in description box i will share one github link so just open that link and i will recommend you please use the online notepad okay now what you have to do just simply scroll down and from here you can see this region so just copy this region and i will recommend you please remember your region because we need in latest step so just copy this region come back over here and paste over here like this now what you have to do you have to just copy this username too just copy this come back over here and paste over here like this and make sure that there is no extra space okay now just copy all this command paste over here hit enter and just simply click on authorize now once all this command can execute you are done with the task number one and task number two now just wait for a couple of seconds and we are done with this and it's done now what you have to do if you just go back to the live instructions and come on the task number three here you can see now what we have to do we have to just log in with the username too so first of all just close this tab and click on leave now just copy this username to open this link in incognito window paste over here hit enter then copy this password and paste over here just wait and click on i understand okay now just we scroll down copy this name lake one wait for a second click on this checkbox and click on agree and continue and i will recommend you please cross verify from here that you are logged in with the username too okay now once you're done with this now just simply search for the data flex click over here just wait click on get started and then click on this manage option then click on this create option paste the name over here which is just copy okay now if you remember for me the region was us east one so i'm going to choose that region like this no need to make any other changes just simply click on create and if you face any issue or any pop error over here no need to worry about that just simply click on this close option and again click on this create now this thing is going to take a couple of minutes meanwhile what we will do we will check the score for the task number one and task number two And as you can see, we get a score on the task number one and task number two without any issue. Now just wait for this task to get complete. And once you're done with this, we will move forward with the next task. And it's finally done now just simply click on this name of lake one like this now what you have to do we have to just create one zone so just copy this zone name click on this add zone and then paste the name over here and make sure that the type must be raw zone okay no need to make any other changes just simply click on create okay and we are done with the task number three now just simply come on the task number four copy this name just wait and here you can see zone one just simply click on this name wait for a second and click on this add assist click on this add and assist and from here you have to choose the type as a storage bucket make sure you have to just choose this type now just paste the name which just copy this one now click on this browse option just wait and click on this arrow like this and just simply click on select now just wait and here you will get green tick as you can see now just simply scroll down click on this done then click on this continue and just choose a inherit click on this continue and submit now just wait for to this class get complete and once it's done we are done with this lab
and it's done now if you just go back to the library instructions and click on the check my progress for task number three you will get a score without any issue and just check the score for the task number four we will get a score without any issue and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys